School holidays can be long and expensive if you don't have a plan in place, but we've got you covered. Here are cheap and creative activities that you can do with your children over the school holidays. First up, you wanna cover your freebies, your free events, and you can discover a variety of events on websites like Eventbrite's and Facebook events. If you're in London, don't miss the South Bank Centre's Children's Festival. It's got a range of fun activities from physical print workshops to yoga and relaxation. Next on the list is free museums. Visit your nearest natural history museum and let your kids walk amongst the dinosaurs or visit a science museum where you can learn all about the amazing and fascinating inventions and discoveries. The Tate Modern in London, the House of Marbles in Devon and the Scottish National Portrait Gallery in Edinburgh are just a few of the many options available. But you can also go to the Money Saving Expert because they have a list of free museums you can check out. Next on the list is visiting cheap or free farms. You can visit a local farm. They're generally run by charities and they'll offer free entry. Plus your little ones will love to see the animals and they may get a chance to pet or feed them. Also, national parks. You can visit one of the UK's most beautiful national parks where your kids can run, play, climb trees, play hide and seek and go wildlife spotting. And you can also visit a waterfall and who doesn't want to visit a waterfall? The UK has many, many beautiful ones and I'll drop the link below of where you can find them. Fourth on our list is toy libraries. There are a thousand in the UK and it's a great way to save money on toys. You go, you can swap books and toys and you only have to pay a small registration fee, but it's much, much cheaper than buying. The next up on our list is nature trails. And I love this one. It's super simple and it's a beautiful way to connect with nature. You can find your local green space and your kids can go on a nature trail where they can identify leaves and bugs and flowers. They can even take a card with loads of different paint colors on and match the colors in nature. You can look for local woodland walks at Forestry England. If you fancy an easy day in, you can treat your children to an online adventure. They can see aquariums, animals in zoos, and take virtual tours of museums like the Natural History Museum, also the Metropolitan Museum of Art, the Smithsonian and the Louvre. And free meals for kids. There are many places in the UK that are offering free or very cheap meals for children. These include Asda Cafe, Morrison's Cafe, Yo Sushi, The Real Greek and Bills. But again, there's actually loads, so just check out the link below. There are plenty of organisations that are running pay what you can schemes so that you only need to pay what you can afford. Enjoy cheap theatre tickets at Nottingham Playhouse or go and visit pay what you can cafes and restaurants like The Real Junk Food Project. So whether you're visiting museums, doing nature trails, going to see waterfalls, national parks, farms, or just simple things like a movie night and board games, there is no shortage of cheap and creative activities that you can do with your children over the school holidays. But I am gonna drop links in the caption so there'll be more resources for you to check there. And also let us know if we've missed anything, that would be really, really helpful. I'm Eliza Pitkin, this is The Big Issue, and give us a follow.